The haters are an absolute disbelief right now. We saw exactly what we discussed yesterday. It did not even take 24 hours for Ada, in fact, to break out of those levels like we talked about earlier in the day. We called it, right? Now, this is despite massive retracements in the market, despite Coinbase going down. Anybody on Coinbase just know that your assets are safe if they're not back, you know, showing up yet in your wallet. But we saw Ada break out of those low ranges fight through 64 cents due to overall strength in the market. And overnight, we actually covered a lot of ground. We broke past the prior cycle of this, this cycle high that we had been at 68 cents. We actually ran all the way to the high 70 cent range this morning. I actually watched it happen and then us retraced down to about 69 cents. So right now, this is our breakout. All right, now we're coming back down. We're retesting right now. The market's actually looking pretty good. BTC floating around 63K. If you guys missed my late video, just overall market analysis video yesterday, I talked about how I would not be surprised if these retracements that we had, these pullbacks from 64K in terms of BTC were erased in 24 to 48 hours. And right now that that's looking like it's going to be the case. Okay. ADA is strong right now. It's performing quite well. In fact, it's, it's pacing a lot of the market. I know that both SHIB and Doge are performing well. I'll, I have a SHIB video that's going to be coming here following this one. But right now, what do we have to contend with? What are we fighting against to continue this move to the upside? That's that's really what I want to talk about here. So I, I looked at the order books, and a big thing we're fighting right now is actually 72 cents. There's a big, big sell wall at 72 cents. So that might be our our next stop here. That might be what, what tries to push ADA down further. Okay. Along the way, 78 cents would probably be our next level. There's not a ton really that was going on there. That was support as we were coming down from our, our bull market highs. So that'd probably be the next place we stop. And then we hit our first hard line in the ADA charts, which is 90 cents. That's our two, three, six line. And it usually takes again, a while for us to get to these levels. Usually it does not happen until post having. So just know that that's typically what happens historically. Now, right now, we're we're outperforming history. It is, again, ahead of where it's supposed to be. BTC is ahead of where it's supposed to be. Many assets are taking big steps forward because, again, BTC broke well above this, this alt season tour. I mean, you can see what's happening here. We we actually really have a chance to, and actually we're ahead of schedule here too, so that's kind of cool. But we are very much ahead of where we should be at this time. We really do have a chance of breaking through that prior bull market high pre having. If that does continue to be the case, I couldn't even tell you where ADA price would be. I think we still won't be at the all time high in terms of ADA. I know people have had a bunch of questions about that. You guys should go watch my, my hundred thousand dollar BTC video where ADA price would be at. But at this time in the market cycle, we don't have the same kind of dominance we did at the height of the bull market cycle last time. So it, it takes time to build up and ramp up to that point. But I expect at some point in the very near future, that begins accelerating, not just for ADA, but for alts throughout the space. So I appreciate you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know your thoughts below. Let me know what you think our next stop is going to be in terms of ADA, but have a great day. Catch you guys in the next one. Take care.